I'm Reggie Mitchell with Apollo Mechanical, and we are in Ellensburg, Washington, uh, currently on the Central Washington Phase Two Science Building job site. It's four stories. Uh, we have a heat recovery unit here, and two air handler units, and we're installing the HVAC duct. Because it's all concrete, we're using the, the spider application. We set the spider on plywood, and then they pour the concrete decking over that, and then below there we have a, a cable. Myself and one other guy walks around and he has a, a stick basic, basically which tells me exactly where the gripple is going to go. So that locates the spot and then I have the gripple spider here and then I basically uh, put it on the spot where it goes. I nail it in and, and then it's done. We, we walk away and we go to the next one. A period of time goes by and uh, they'll come through, the iron workers will put their rebar down and then they will do a pour, so the concrete will pour on top of the gripple and that will actually be encased inside the concrete so you won't see it anymore. After that pour is done, they pull the plywood from down below, so what you'll see is that black grommet and all you do at that point is you get your, uh, your cable and you, it just slides in there like that and it grips in and it, and it does not come out. So uh, it's, a, it's a great product and it's that easy. Well, the main differences that I see between the gripples and the threaded rod is there's a lot of waste and time consumption as far as labor hours and getting down out of a lift and cutting up a bunch of stuff. And with the gripples, they, they give you a little handle and you just cut the remainder. I leave a little extra in case I have to make an adjustment like six to seven inches. But if you're throwing away anything, it's a little thin wire and, and not all this all thread. You know, when you really think about it, over the course of a $10 million job, you're throwing away half a mile of all thread. Well, honestly, my first impression of Gripple as compared to uh, Threaded Rod, there was a little apprehension, a little confusion. But the longer you work with it, the easier it is to use. Uh, it's easy adjustments, kind of slams up there. And I could actually see it being the future. To anybody that's skeptical about the product, you know, I'd say uh, just come work with me and you'll see from yourself not only uh, how less labor intensive it is, but uh, cost-wise too.